Welcome to Garrett's Flight School. In this video you will be seeing a recording of the takeoff and landing procedure, the figure eight procedure so you can get an idea of what your flight test should look like. When you see this you're going to see the takeoff and landing in a short clip of where it's taking off and where it's coming back down. You can do that or you can do the takeoff and fly, do your figure eight, come back and land. Um, how you split that up is up to you. Okay, the first one you'll see is the takeoff and landing, and then we'll move into the figure eight formation. You'll see a large copter um, being flown. You will be taking your test on a small copter. Okay, here you see an example of the flight plan. You're going to see me kind of use a pen here on the flight plan a little bit. Uh, and I'm going to, but I'm going to show you how to fill one out for the flight test so you have that as an example. Okay, to start off with here, you're going to start, let me get my pen. Here, pen. Okay, so I've got my little pen here. You're going to put the date you want to fly. So let's say I want to fly next Monday. I would put in the 14th and 15. And again, I apologize for the kind of hard to read things here. Then, but that's what you know, technology I have at this point. Okay, then your name as the pilot. Okay, so this would be where I would put my name as the pilot. And, okay, and I'm just going to abbreviate my last name here. Okay, there's my name as the flight. I'd list out, you'd list out who you want on your flight team as the navigator, who's going to play mission control, who's going to be the spotter, and who's going to be the second spotter. Okay, you're going to be selecting the Cheerson X-10, that's your copter. Okay, the reason for flight would be to do a flight IG H, whoops, T, sorry about that, flight and you could just simply put flight test or pilot's license. T-E-S-T. So you can simply just put flight test. Your route, that's going to be based on either this. And again, you're going to start here. I'll do an example. You're going to start, come out. And you, know, you can go into and say, hey, I'm going to do my figure eight like this. And go around like that and then come back here and land here okay. making sure that you're ex xing out let me change colors here oops turning off my pen pen and let's see if i can change ink color i'm going to go to blue here so i would say you know my starting point is here you would mark that one that one uh, looks like maybe that one coming up definitely that one you know, and so on and so forth, wherever these, this would be your flight plan, these would be the coordinates that you put into your um, flight, into the flight plan. Okay. And I'll show you an example. It doesn't have to be this one. You could come way out here over the table. You know, that's up to you. Okay, you could do another flight plan. Here it is here. You'd have the table here. So you could start, you know, I'll pen in a table here. You'd have your starting point here. And let me get a different color here to mark this one up. We'll do this one in green. So you could say, okay, I'm just going to fly straight out. And when I get to here, I'm going to go around, come around here like this, and come around here like that. And then I'm going to fly back in and land it that way. And again, you know, marking out these points here, starting point here, and then coordinates here, coordinate there definitely a coordinate there coordinate there I'm going to tell you know coordinate there get your zero zero in there um, 
it's going to be up to you the you know what you know what kind of a figure eight or what your figure eight is going to look like um, when you're doing your um, flight plan and so I think I've got all my coordinates matched so I'm going to go back to the flight plan so that's you'd put in your coordinates here print it out submit make sure you sign it so I'm going to I would go as the navigator my navigator would sign it and then we they'd review it and then you'd submit it and then I would review it and then I would sign it get it back to you on the day of your flight test or I would give it back to you with changes that need to be made alright so you've seen an example of takeoff and landing you've seen an example of um, the figure eight and you kind of see how kind of un not unstable but you know what an example of what in control looks like you've also seen an example of how to fill out the flight plan Good luck on your flight test. You know, make sure you get some practice, but also make sure you get your flight plan in ahead of time so you can get in the cal on the calendar to take your flight test. You may take your flight test as many times as you want to get your 18.75 points or better to earn your license. Um, also, let me know what I can do to help. Good luck and happy flying.